Bang of Babington took place in 1898. Mr Percy Buckley, secretary of the Guildford Babington Club, organised the first ever open doubles badminton tournament. The Guildford tournament was the first open tournament in 1898. Because of its success, the Babington Association organised its first event the following year, including the two singles competitions to the doubles. In 1898, the first open tournament was played at Guildford. Um, when I say open, this is where people from other clubs were allowed to play there. And it was so popular, this tournament, that the next year the Bampton Association ran their own tournament. For the first few years it was called the Association Tournament. And then it was called the All England. Um, and one of the major things about the promotion and why lots of clubs wanted to join was because of the All England Bampton Championships. You see the, the number of clubs vastly increase as soon as the All England started. My first interest in, in uh, the history of Bampton was when somebody sent me a photograph of the 1904 All England and it is the first photograph of the All England um, but on the history side it was when somebody sent this uh, 1904 uh, All England thing, and I got interested in the history and then eventually I joined the museum and have been involved in the Bampton Museum for the last 19 years or so. This one here is of a house in Sheldon, in Timmouth, in Devon. And this is the house where the first All England champion lived. And we believe because they could practice badminton outside, this is why the, the Devon girls were so good. There was four of them in the final and they, they never lost a game in the first All England right the way through. And you can see they're particularly good because you can see that they're uh, doing jump smashes here and um, round the head action shots there in their long dresses. Uh, and this is actually Muriel Lucas here, who's actually playing. And um, she was so much stronger, she usually played at the back of the court. Quite a few of the photographs we have where she's playing at the back of the court. And there she is again there at the back of the court. And this guy here is um, Stuart Massey who was the first uh, All England champion. And this, this chap here is Ralph Nichols, and he is the last Englishman to win the All England. 